Looks like pinballs is happening there. This is the calm before the storm. Come Sunday, tens of thousands of people will be there for the much anticipated Eddie Icau Big Wave Invitational. Just about an hour ago, city officials laid out their plans to help people get to the bay and keep everyone safe. Our Mark Carpenter is here with the details tonight. Mark? Yeah, Kiahi, thank you very much. This will just be the ninth time that the Eddie goes because, as we know, the bay calls the day. Conditions have to be just right. And the city is working with the Aikau family to pull off the event safely and successfully. And to that end, the state says there will be no parking on either side of Kamehameha Highway from Iliohu Place to the Saints Peter and Paul Mission Church starting at 10 p.m. tomorrow. That'll last until the contest is over. To help alleviate traffic congestion, the city is increasing the bus routes from Honolulu to Waimea Bay. There will be four additional buses starting early at 4.30 a.m. from Ala Moana Center to the North Shore. The buses will be going every half hour until 6 a.m. The city will also provide shuttles running along Kamehameha Highway. We want everybody to have a safe and comfortable experience getting to the eddy. It might be difficult, it might be a long ride. Just plan in advance and be ready for some traffic out there. We do ask that people remember that this is not just an athletic event. This is a, a tribute in honor of one of our most famous lifeguards at the city and county who risked his life year after year to rescue people. And we want to ask people to please be respectful of his memory and the fact that this is also a cultural event. We're looking at a slow start for probably the first two heats, but after that, it's going to be building. And we're in the afternoon especially, we're looking at waves at 25 feet Hawaiian. On a national scale, that's 50 feet. And we may get some 30-footers local scale and 60-foot national scale. Just remarkable numbers. Now, organizers do not want personal drones to be flown over Waimea Bay during the event. There will also be no concessions at the park, so remember to bring your own food and drinks. And, of course, take all of your trash with you when you leave. The city says extra emergency personnel will also be on standby because of the supersized surf, not only on the North Shore, but also along Leeward Oahu. Now let's turn to Ben Gutierrez for an update on the surf.